Hey guys, it's Aaron from Pete's RV Center in South Burlington, Vermont. Just wanted to show you the brand new Jayco floor plan that they've come out with. It's a Jayco JFlay SLX 7 wide, 183 RB. It's a great new addition to the lineup. As you can see, it's a nice small camper and I'll show you the weight sticker in just a second. But let's go over some features as well as the floor plan, just kind of show you if it's right for you. One, you're getting a nice front windshield right here. That's perfect for letting a lot of light in, as well as opening it up when you get inside. The bed's right on the other side there, so you don't feel so trapped in once you get inside. Moving down, you're going to see the rock shield. Perfect for deflecting rocks, kicking up to the vehicle, not damaging the aluminum to the actual unit. It's going to deflect all that. And while we're down there, I just want to show you the A-frame. Now, it's one of Jayco's standard features that they run. It's a foundation piece. It's an integrated A-frame. That frame goes all the way through that front cross member into the actual inside frame so that it's a more stable towing experience for you going down the road. Get you the full angle here. You're gonna notice the powered awning. There is an LED light strip I'll show you in just a second. Huge storage bag right here. So you're gonna get all of this room. You got the flooring from inside in there so that even if your camp you know, chair is wet, something's damp and you put it in there, it's not gonna affect the wood. Um, it's a really, really nice feature to have. Back up here. You're gonna see the LED light strip right under here. All the way through. So you're not annoying your neighbors, but you're having some light in front of your camper at night. Second big piece to that towing aspect, you're gonna have Goodyear tires as well as Dexter axles. Goodyear tires, as you know, is American made. It's just, you, you can't go wrong with them. I know a lot of people who purchase other trailers that automatically switch over. This is part of the package. You don't need to pay extra to swap over to new tires that aren't from overseas. And you'll also see, so let me focus in, never adjust an easy lube brake system in there. Good year endurance. Get you a shot of the back here. Also some big features, as you may or not know, Jayco has a two year warranty. They've had it for an extremely long time. That's two full camping seasons covered by them. And now they've just added the three year structural warranty to it. So you get two year limited um, warranty as well as a three year structural warranty, which goes a long ways for customers that are just purchasing. Now let's head inside. You'll notice there's two steps here. So you're not having to jump so high, making an easy transition in and out. Looking in weight sticker 3303 pounds is the weight this sits as is so no cargo just as we are now that's awesome that's a really really low weight a lot of suvs nowadays can easily tow this without pushing the engine or anything like that so the first thing we're going to notice is the bed it's not wall the wall over here it's your normal. Both people can get in on either side. No one's got a log roll to get out. That's an awesome feature that people are looking for in a couple's camper. Above it, you have storage around. Nice wardrobe kind of built on the side with glass inlay. And then a ton of storage. And not just your shelf where things are going to fall off in transit. You can actually use that as a good storage piece. And you don't see that a lot over the bed. AC built right into the side so that you can cool yourself down in those hot summer days. Another big feature I like about this unit, that's going to be your emergency exit, which opens. But on your other side, transitioning around, this window is also going to open. That's going to give you a lot of nice cross ventilation in that hot summer night. We don't have to run the AC. Some campgrounds have uh, time if you're running a generator and things like that. You can cool this place down without having to use an AC all the time. Moving on, you're going to see the slide. It's your dinette system. Plenty of space for people. If it's a wet, rainy day, you guys play cards. It also converts to a bed in case you need a, an extra sleeping spot for a friend or family member. Spinning around, I'll show you the kitchen area. You get storage on both sides of the microwave for food, any kind of plates and things like that. Going down, you're going to have your traditional tube burner off of propane off the front. And then your sink built right there. Even more storage going down, as well as your furnace and breaker box. And then to the side, you're gonna notice your Dometic fridge. What's awesome about this fridge is it's still propane. So 
it's not just a 12 volt battery so if you really like to go off the grid do some camping you can use the propane aspect as well as the auto feature that allows you to be a you know plugged in and if for some reason you lose power it's not just going to lose all your food it's going to switch the propane automatically for you here you have a lot of your switches as well as your uh, slide out and awning button so you can see it's all powered there's going to be where you control your tanks as well as your water pump water heater through gas and electric so nice easy placement to do that so you're not outside starting everything switching to the bathroom I love this bathroom when you got a skylight up above lets a lot of light in as well as height for you above the shower toilet and then look at all the storage in the sink area perfect for a couples camper you know a lot of times you don't see a sink in these models you got to go outside and use the kitchen one this is all built one bathroom awesome awesome feature awesome floor plan just kind of give you one more look if you have any questions about the unit please reach out to me all my information is in the bio and i look forward to seeing you